It was well worth the watch and it has like a really good sneaky twist at the end. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little movie review on Presumed Innocent from I think 1990 starring Harrison Ford. So I feel like I had looked through all the main Harrison Ford movies, especially around this time. And somehow I overlooked this movie. It's a mystery, it's rated very highly. Let's jump into the pros that I have with this movie. And I think this is a solid late 80s, early 90s mystery movie. Harrison Ford's character, like he plays a character that I've never seen Harrison Ford play. And he kind of doesn't really reveal very much. So you kind of never really know where he actually stands. Is he bad? Is he good? It's interesting that Harrison Ford plays this character because he'll probably never play a character like this again. Now, I do have more to say about this in my mixed, but it, it is definitely an attempt to do something 100% new and authentic. It almost sets up like a lot of movies that came before this. Maybe two thirds through the movie, it really does switch and become its own movie. So they have this like catchy jingle for this movie and it is it's a good jingle it's a catchy jingle and the last thing i liked about this movie was it had a pretty good punchline of who done it all these things were going on you kind of never know is harrison ford bad is harrison ford good because of the way he plays his character who the bad person ends up being in this i absolutely never guess completely caught me off guard and it's kind of nice because you almost think it's somebody else for like a minute or two. Really caught me off guard, an excellent twist. All right guys, I'm gonna jump into my mixed aspects. And my mixed aspects with this movie is Harrison Ford's performance. Now, Harrison Ford is playing probably the least likable, least entertaining person that we've ever seen. There's none of that Indiana Jones in here, none of that Harrison Ford in Star Wars vibe where he's just the man, is making everything easy and entertaining not in this movie and he's doing a character that he's never done before so i appreciate that it helps keep the mystery of is harrison ford good or bad and it's also different i've never seen harrison ford play a character like this but it was just so unentertaining to watch oh yeah i'm, I'm playing this character i have no emotion yeah all right guys let's jump into the cons of this movie now the cons i had was it was pretty slow for my taste personally. It felt like so many other movies around this time and I'm like not really a big fan of like courtroom dramas. There are some courtroom dramas that I would probably enjoy, probably more like action adventure, things like that. But just a long drama in a courthouse just really isn't my thing. There's a point where the villain is revealed and this person refers to themselves in the third person in like a trance. And it's just so cringy. Once I saw, you know, who the villain was, I was like, oh wow, this is like, I'm just really caught off guard. And I completely zoned out to the whole speech. There's like a two minute speech and the other person is just sitting there listening and it's just like, wow, this is so dramatic and cringy, you know? I'd probably give this movie a seven out of 10. As far as buy, try or pass, I would probably go, either try or pass depending on who you are maybe you'd like it enough to own because it does have a really good twist at the end if you want to rent it it's kind of going to depend on who you are as a person do you appreciate these late 80s early 90s mysteries did you remember that time at all or are you like you know i'm just not really going to go to the 80s bro probably not the 90s i want something newer i totally get you probably avoid this one it was well worth the watch and it has like a really good sneaky twist at the end anyways guys let me know what you think of presumed innocent we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers and i couldn't do it without any of your help you guys are the best having a great day out here hopefully i'm a great day at home see you all in the next video peace